Welcome to DevKit Weekly, where this week we'll be exploring the XPLR M9 Standard Precision GNSS Explorer Kit from Ublox. So positioning is something we all pretty much take for granted. I mean, think about it. You can never get where you're going if you don't first know where you are. Uh, this week's development kit, the Explorer M9 XPLR M9, is a standard precision uh, GNSS uh, kit, which is actually really anything uh, but standard. So the XPLR uh, M9 is more than just a standard precision kit. It's really a complete development platform uh, that targets developments in uh, automotive, uh, logistics, um, you know, asset tracking, pretty much anything uh, in which a location and accuracy uh, would be beneficial to the end use case. Based on Ublox M9 family of GNS chips and modules, the XPLR uh, can achieve down to meter level accuracies by supporting concurrent reception uh, with four GNS constellations, Beidou, Galileo, GLONASS, and GPS or GNSS. And because it can access uh, all four of these constellations at once and uh, select the best signal from any of them, uh, it even delivers really, really good meter level performance in deep urban canyon environments and other places where it's typically very difficult to achieve accurate signals. So on the Explorer kit itself, users will find a USB Type-C interface uh, that provides power as well as connectivity to a development PC. As soon as you plug the kit into the aforementioned uh, development PC, whatever you happen to be using, all of the drivers needed to get up and running are downloaded automatically provided that you have an internet connection. Uh, so there's really no need to go searching around the internet uh, trying to find uh, any drivers and then trying to figure out whether they're the right ones or not. So then after that, you would then uh, just connect the kit to this uh, uh, active GNSS antenna, which is included um, through the SMA connector, which is right over here on the other side of the board from the USB Type-C interface. Alternatively to the uh, GNSS antenna here, you could use simulation, but we'd only like the real thing here on DevKit Weekly. So that takes us to the final component of the XPLR M9, which is obviously software. With the kit comes an SD card that contains an installer for uh, Ublox's U-Start, uh, which is an evaluation environment uh, that is designed specifically for use with the XPLR M9 kit itself. So U-Start contains a demonstration package that allows you to see the number of sa satellites in each constellation that are visible uh, from your position, well, technically the position of the kit. So at that point, you can choose to connect to one of them, and it also lets you um, enable satellite or ground-based augmentation systems that help increase the accuracy um, of positioning. Uh, and the way that those work is by broadcasting uh, correction messages between satellites, um, you know, towers that, that may be deployed, um, and the uh, endpoint GNSS device itself, which should also be your position. So Ustart even provides uh, free temporary access to Ublox's uh, Assist Now online and Assist Now offline services. And these services offer aiding data such as um, ephemeris, time, um, and course positioning, which help boost positioning performance. So instead of waiting minutes or even hours or perhaps longer to get signals from the GNS satellites that you would be using to calculate your position, um, and mind you, you need to have it signals from at least four, Assist Now Online and Assist Now Offline um, use that aiding data um, to really accelerate that down to even uh, just a few seconds. And that's even in conditions where you have poor signal or limited or intermittent connectivity even. So when you take all of those different uh, features of the XPLR M9 and the Ustart uh, software together, um, it allows you to determine your own position on Google Maps um, in a little demo application um, in a matter of minutes from just actually taking this thing out of the box. So for power users who want a little bit more, you can also upgrade from Ustart to the Ucenter uh, software and development environment from um, from Ublox, and that just provides a little bit extra in the way of uh, testing, validation, visualization, and analysis for OEMs and system integrators. Oh, and one final note is that once you get up and running, there's 16 gigabytes of storage 
on that aforementioned uh, SD card and you can use that for storing historical uh, location data or maybe even some application data if you're so inclined. So all in all, the Ublox XPLR M9 uh, can really help fast track location-based system designs for um, anybody who, who's interested in getting positioning into their end use case. All you need to get started is a PC that runs at least Windows 7, and besides that, 129 bucks, which is how much you will have to pay for this thing on the commercial market. Or you could enter this week's raffle and try to get this one for free. Um, you can register for the raffle by clicking the link that's on the uh, screen here and then also listed in the description below. If you'd like to find out more about the XPLR uh, M9 kit, you can find that on the uBlocks website at uBlocks.com. Other than that, good luck in this week's raffle and we'll see you next week on DevKit Weekly.